One day, Tony Sandberg, my manager, came to me and said, uh, Henrik said he wanted to talk to you. I thought, wow, oh, the CEO of Scania would want to talk to me. We will have a meeting 7 o'clock on Monday morning. I think I got up uh, 15 minutes earlier than usual, because uh, some meetings you don't want to be late. Hey, good morning, Robert. Morning. How are you doing? Good. good to see you, good to see you. So, thanks for seeing me <laughs> this early on a Monday morning. We sat down by the table and uh, then he uh, explained that uh, he wanted to see a solution for a future city. The future of uh, transport in cities. Now I'm talking about 2030 and beyond. He wanted us to do something new, something different. Like a vehicle that can carry uh, people in the morning, uh, maybe goods during the day, yeah. garbage maybe during the night, that sort of flexibility. I don't know if it makes sense. You know... That's the place where he left the room. I, I will show you something. Ho hold on a second. You know, this is... Um, <laughs> this is my Lego from, uh, I think, 1975 or something like that. Uh, that I uh, brought and Then he started to, to put them together, these pieces, to, to show a different way of modernization. Sort of during the day, you can, in a way, then uh, run with uh, goods. And, and then with the same sort of uh, concept, you can have this as a unit to be able to, to move around on, on, a, uh, on a site or, or um, in a garage or something. This project is about building something that we have not built before. And um, yeah, that was the starting point. But I mean, flexible in design, modularized as units. What do you think? Can we make this happen? So I, I said to Henrik, this will take 15 people building it for two years. Yeah. And then he said, OK, I will we'll talk, talk to, to the, the CTO. CTO. Yeah. And that was more or less the end of the meeting. And uh, yeah, and the rest is history, I would say.